Welcome to today's session where we will be looking at log profiles and specifically editing log profiles on your iPhone. So I've got a film open on my device here now and it's a behind the scenes of me with the camera and a dancer creating a dance film this year. So I shoot all of my work in log. This clip was actually shot on my iPhone using the Moment app. And we spoke about the Moment app in an earlier session. Okay, so normally when I'm working with log footage, I'll go into an editing program such as DaVinci Resolve. And I'm about to do a series of workshops editing with the DaVinci Resolve 2. But for now, we're focusing on mobile devices. So I've edited this shot in log format. Normally, as I said, I'd go into an editing program on my computer and work through the log that way. But there's a really simple way you can do this on your iPhone or an iPad in the Photos app. So I've opened the footage. All I'm going to do is click Edit, and that brings me up into the Edit panel. So I'm just going to click this little button down here, and that brings me a menu at the side. So first thing I'm going to do is just click the Auto button. So what this does is it cleverly calculates what it thinks the image should look like. It still looks a little bit flat to me, so I'm just going to go through this and work on it a bit more. So I just change the exposure up a little bit, increase the highlights, drop the shadows, increase the contrast and go back to my exposure and just brighten that up a little bit. And then I'm just going to go to my black point and drop that down. And I'm doing this by eye, as you can see. So I'm just moving the sliders up and down till I get a look that I'm happy with. Let's make it a little bit sharper there. Reduce the noise. So I shot this um, as the sun went down. So it's quite dark. So it's quite noisy. Um, so I'm just going to reduce a little bit of that noise. I don't want to vignette it. So that's looking pretty good. It's looking less flat. So all I'm going to do now is click the pre-installed templates. And as you'll see on the right side, I've got a list of options. So I'm just going to scroll through them. I do like a dramatic black and white, but that's not what I'm looking for right now. So, ah, there we go. Wonderful. So you can see with the standard Photos app on either your iPhone or your iPad, you can work with your log footage to create it really vibrant. Guys, thank you so much for doing this lesson, and I'll see you at the next one.